Yes. Hello. Hello. My name is Gabriela Hamori. I'm an actress from Hungary and I'm representing here in Montreal a film, The Exam, that is a political thriller. It's, um, its topic is a bit um, heavy because uh, after the screening I was asked uh, uh, about the background of the story because um, it's not very well known everywhere in the world. Uh, it's, um, the story is at, um, the, during the communist era and it's an unrecovered part of the Hungarian history. Um, the story is at Christmas Eve and the main characters is a young man and an older man and their relation like father and son but um, in fact they work together and in a surveillance agency and at Christmas Eve there's an exam because the whole system construction of the agency needs to be recruited <laughs> So it's um, it's a thriller and a love story in the same time, and it examines the film itself, how human nature behaves in an authoritarian system as the communism was. And what is your role in the film? I I play a cello player, theoretically, who had connections with the revolution in '56, and. Um, She's full of secrets. I like story and I like the story and I like my role in the story. It's very exciting. You, you like playing a mean part yeah. as in this movie? Very you enjoyed? <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. I like to explore these complications in the role and in the whole system, how we behave in the in the set. We the script is well well is is very, very complicated. And we try to figure out what is the best for the story to maintain the very um, positive energy through the film. So, your film has shown in Carlo Vivari and yeah. Montreal, which was, which are two of the most important film festivals in around the world. This is great. Tell us uh, any more plans of other film festivals going? Yeah, I um, I had news that. Um, there are going to be screenings at Chicago Film Festival and at Calcutta. So we are very happy for that. And I work together with the director in a former film, in this former film. And also the scriptwriter worked together with him. So our crew is uh, really, um, we know each other well. And we get to use to each other uh, <laughs> all, all, all the... Um, all the moods and, and way of thinking that we have. In Spe speaking of mood and I should say ambiance, uh, how do you how are you enjoying Montreal, the festival, the oh, yeah. city? It's a good question because uh, this is my first time here and I was expecting a gorgeous city because all my friends told me that this is the best part of the world and indeed it's, it's a brilliant city. Unfortunately, I have to leave today. I'm sure that I'm going to return. And the festival is really unique for me because uh, it, it seems for me that it has a responsible for get to know each other. And the selection is really interesting for me. I've seen different films from Latin, Amer Latin America, African films, and I've seen a gorgeous movie, for example, that was directed by an American director and he made it in, um, in Senegal and the whole society in Senegal just came so close and it was so truthful and the attitude of the director was so selfless so I'm very happy to see films like that uh, the title was Tall as... Um, what kind of tree? Do you know that? Baobab? Baobab, yeah, the title was Tall as Baobab Yeah. Good, and how about the social, I mean, is the festival good for organizing uh, connection, yeah. professional connections between actresses, directors, producers, and how does they do it? Where? Yeah, it's very important, and um, 
I know theoretically it's very important to <laughs> be on all the events, but mostly I watched films. Mm -hmm. I talked about the films with the directors and filmmakers, but uh, deliberately I didn't seek uh, any connection as an actress because um, it's really uh, far from my nature. <laughs> mm -hmm. But but just by itself things are happening, so it's a very very good. Uh, very well organized place. You would recommend? Yeah, of course. <laughs> definitely, definitely. It's very friendly. Good, a toast to that. I mean, thank you very much. Thank you so much.